Jared and I have been best friends since we were 14 years old in middle school, and we operate the world's only multimedia co aquaculture studio. Here in Miami, we have the intersection of a coral reef ecosystem with a major cosmopolitan city. And so if we're trying to understand how coral reefs are going to adapt in the future and throughout the world, um, starting in a place like Miami where you know, we're seeing corals that in fact are colonizing you know, the shipping channel, um, you know, living along seawalls, living in the FEC slip, um, living along the highway, you know, these corals, from our perspective, you know, might be some of the most important corals on the planet. The Deep Dredge is a project that is being undertaken by the Army Corps of Engineers and Government Cut here in Miami. And Government Cut's being deepened to allow larger ships to come into Port Miami. And as part of the deepening, they need to cut into uh, the coral reef. As of June 7th, all of the corals that are living on the second and third reef tracks are going to be dynamited and blasted. So we basically have a clock that's ticking, and we have to get in the water as much as we can and try to remove as many of the corals that are left behind. Whatever we can't collect is going to be destroyed. And these are corals that are incredibly valuable. They can be utilized for scientific research, for public aquariums, for education, um, and to be able to lose such you know, these precious animals that are already threatened in the wild, um, it just seems like a shame. So basically we are we're going as hard as we can, diving as much as we can, um, taking a lot of risks and getting out in the government cut to try and, and rescue as many of these corals as we can. project that basically is going to destroy a whole lot more corals than probably any private uh, contractor or company or individual has you know, managed to do themselves. Um, you know, it's, it's just it's a shame when there's so much research, so much public education that can come from these corals. Um, you know, we want to, to share with the public and the people of Miami to show that you know, in fact that this isn't just a sterile shipping channel, it's not just an industrial um, kind of zone, it's actually a thriving ecosystem. 